sponsor. Kate O'Shea was at the University of D.C. where bands and other performers are practicing for tomorrow's big event. And Blackish star Anthony Anderson was getting ready so for funny. his role as Grand Marshal. Of course, there will be also floats and balloons. Come out and see the ABC7 team as we carry the Where's Waldo balloon. This thing is going to be huge. It's a big one. Uh, <laughs> I'll be out there as well with uh, Nancy and Bill, so come on by and say hello. If you can't make it to the parade, though, you can watch it live on WJLA.com starting at 10 a.m., or you can watch it right here on ABC7 at noon. And I was scheduled to be Should out of town. Otherwise, I would have been out there for sure. Oh, is that right? In years, in years past, I've been, I love that. It's so much yeah. fun. If you've not been to this thing ever, come on out and enjoy it. It's great. You yeah, feel like a kid a, again watching. It's a big yeah. deal. I mean, anytime you shut down Constitution Avenue, you know something's going right. on like that. Uh, so it's great. It'll be fun to work with him in the booth, too. You yeah, know. He's, oh, he's so funny. He yeah. is funny, and he, I guarantee he's going to go off script. Right, <laughs> exactly. And it may be a timing issue <laughs> yes. for the directors. Exactly right. Good luck. So we have some rain around the area right now. Look at the beautiful color, the tidal base. And of course, the blossoms are now gone for the most part. We're seeing a lot of those green leaves and the pink leaves as well. 67 outside in D.C. right now. You got 63 in Gaithersburg, Martinsburg at 62, Leonardtown into the upper 60s. So the next few hours, that's where we keep it, mid and upper 60s. We bring in that chance or continued uh, rainfall with the potential for a few thunderstorms here and there. Right now, it's just some light rain falling around D.C. Most of the D.C. area and surrounding region uh, is not its dry. It's not raining right now, but we do have some moderate to heavy rainfall that's coming down up and down I-81, the Shenandoah Valley. Look at this into Loudoun County back near Percival, heading on up towards sections of Washington and Frederick County, Maryland. This doesn't look like it has a ton of lightning with it, if any, but it does have some moderate rainfall and certainly cloudy uh, outside with reduced visibility. This is a shot in Hagerstown. We're looking off to the west-northwest, and you can see the reduced visibility there in that low cloud deck. So as we look ahead to your night tonight, we just, uh, start this at 8 o'clock. We continue to see these showers and the potential for some thunderstorms. If you're heading out tonight, plan for rain. It's not going to rain continuously for three, four, five hours, but you could have times that you get some of that moderate rainfall and then it moves through. And that's the trend for the entire overnight hour time frame. Three o'clock in the morning, a line of showers, maybe the rumble of thunder pushing through our area. Seven o'clock in the morning when a lot of these floats are getting ready to line up for that parade. Rain, seven, eight o'clock. I think that's likely into even nine o'clock in the morning when a lot of people start to line the streets there by 10 and then 11 and 12 for the parade. We're cautiously optimistic that the, those showers will be gone cloudy and everything will be damp. But then the afternoon looking really nice. I mean, how about these numbers tomorrow afternoon? Mid 70s, maybe even some upper 70s as we head on into the day. But then we advance to Sunday afternoon and evening. This is a little bit of a greater weather threat. And this is about 10 o'clock at night through about five o'clock in the morning or so on Monday. And we'll be tracking a stronger cold front cutting through the overnight hours. Bad in one way in that it's into the overnight hours, but that's also good and it will help uh, uh, at least lessen the severe weather threat in our area. You combine that with peak heating of the day and that's when things really can blow up. So that's what we're watching. That moves through some lingering showers early on Monday morning. So bringing it all together, mid to upper 70s both days. Lingering showers in the morning for your day tomorrow, dry in the afternoon. Most of Sunday morning is dry. We bring in most of the day for that matter. We bring in the showers and the storm potential late Sunday into the overnight hours and into Monday morning. We dry it out for a few days and repeat the pattern by the end of the week. There you go. That's a look at your weather forecast. Have a great night, Chip. We'll send it over to you. Thanks, Bill. Capitals are 15 wins away from defending the Stanley Cup. The players and coaches aren't as thrilled as their supporters following their opening performance in the playoffs last night. They explain in sports. Keep it locked. The unknown beyond the horizon. That was once our frontier. But today, a new frontier has risen. And this is the vehicle crafted to conquer it. Introducing the first of its kind Lexus UX and UXF Sport. Also available in hybrid all wheel drive. Lease the 2019 UX 200 for $329 a month for 36 months. Experience amazing at your Lexus dealer. Choose your family, but you can choose your family vacation. Bring them together on the beaches of.